Bedford are praising the police for making a quick arrest in the shooting that caused panic during the town's Christmas parade last night. CBS North Carolina's Steve Sprasia shows us how the events unfolded. Everybody started scattering as like just, I mean, it was really chaotic for a few seconds. Just up the road from James Partington, shots rang out in the parking lot of this grocery store right on the parade route. The parade was halfway through when the gunshots fired. Um, there was about seven or eight gunshots that was fired. Surveillance video captured the scary scene. The store owner releasing the dramatic pictures to CBS North Carolina. The shooting takes place in the shadows at the top of your picture. There was a young guy laying on the ground that had been shot, and then the cops had another fellow in custody that I believed was a suspect. Police say 18-year-old Sean Matthews suffered several gunshot wounds to the abdomen. 16-year-old Jadakus Tyser was shot in the arm. Because police were deployed for the Christmas parade, an arrest happened within minutes. It was uh, good work by the Sanford Police Department. They caught the guy immediately. 20-year-old Dion Johns is accused of the shooting and made a court appearance via video link. In court today, the judge upped the suspect's bond from 365000 to a million and a half after the DA said that Johns was a danger to the community. But Johns' father says his son is not like that. He's a pretty good kid, you know. Like I said, he, he got two priors. He's not a saint or anything like that. Two misdemeanors, you know. Got kids. Spent a lot of time with him. Just all around pretty good kid, you know. So what motivated the shooting? Coming up at 6, we'll tell you a father's theory about what he thinks might have been the cause. I'm Steve Sprasia, CBS, North Carolina.